YouTube, it's me, Monster Nico, and what's up with you? Anyways, I am doing a haul of my favorites throughout the year, and I do have some favorites from last last year, 2014, but I didn't do a video for that because around that time I was in my car and so that phase, and I was trying to recover, but I'm all good now, so yeah, I just want to go ahead and record and put a bunch of videos out because I'm going to start school soon, so let's just go ahead and do this. Anyways, the first thing is from Walmart. It was $10, so this is backpack. I love this backpack so much. I love the letter, thick letter on it, and it's, it holds a lot, to be honest. I have, like, this bag's halfway full, and I can still fit stuff in here, which amazes me because I needed a backpack for work when I was working before I got hurt, and um, then it said no more backpacks. I was like, what? I spent money on a backpack I didn't need? But that was like $10, and I bought it at Walmart right after work. I was working dirt shift. Told my mom, hey, I need to go to Walmart. Went to Walmart, and I was so up for a night shift, and I was like, <laughs> zombie five. And I got a backpack. And I still use it if, if I'm going to go out, or I don't have a purse, and um, just go out if I need to change clothes or butter or whatever, I, I use that. So, yeah. I have the Chapstick Me Eva. I got this for a Christmas present. It wasn't just one single crisp. It was. Just, it just wasn't chapstick. It was like a whole, uh, thing of body wash stuff, which I didn't want, but I gave the rest to everybody. I gave like body wash stuff to everybody else on Notion, but I kept the chapstick because I needed chapstick, and I haven't used it in a while, so I hope it's good. Yeah, it's good, and um, I like it a lot, and it, I don't like chapstick that has flavor in it because it's disgusting. I like non citric chapstick because it's the best. I got this uh blanket and this is a. I'm not gonna tell you the story about how I got this blanket. I am not, but it is a short blanket on me because I'm tall, guys. I'm like five eleven. Okay, so yeah, and it's American flag colors, of course, depending on how you see it, and um, it's handmade. I didn't make it, but. Someone gave it to me, and I was like very appreciative of it. I was like, thank you so much. So, I'm not even telling you the story behind that, because that has a story, and it will blow you guys' mind. I'll be here forever telling you guys the story. Also, I got uh, Skull Candy Reggae headphones, and I got this on sale on their website. And I was like, thank you, Jesus, because I need headphones, and I love Skull Candy headphones, because they last long. For me, they last super long, and I can, I think it's, been half a year and they haven't gone bad on me which is amazing because like every time I buy headphones it does not last long at all and I'm going like Ugh. I had to buy another one but school candies last long with me and I appreciate it that was like ten dollars this also was like two for ten these uh, water bottles it's cool gear these are the best water bottles you can have because it stays cold all day it, 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 it was like really hot outside and Alabama is known for its well, the South is known for its heat and if I take this outside, go ahead and go work with it. it I'll still have ice at half the day, which will amaze me. And if I don't touch it, you know, that much, I'll still have ice in it. I'm like, what? I still have ice in this? And a lot of people have commented, you still have ice in it after it's been a hot day? I'm like, heck yeah. And I'll go ahead and sip it just to make people envious of me. But I can have nice ice cold water. Drinking more water to be more healthier. And it's foam insulated, which means it keeps water uh colder longer and it has a twist off lid and you can put whatever you want inside i keep water because water is my drink and you can open it to drink it like this like that and it's open and this is how you close it like that and to drink it you just do this and it's delicious it's just water i probably said alcohol i wouldn't keep alcohol on. i would not keep alcohol on this because um, I'll forget I have alcohol in here and have a messed up day. It has, it holds 32 ounces. And you can put whatever you want in there. So again, it's Cool Gear. They have a website. Do they have a website? Yeah, www.coolgearinc.com. You can purchase it online if you want. It may be more expensive, but it's totally worth it. And uh, it, hurts, it holds a lot of water. I can fill this up three times a day if I'm very thirsty. Uh, this is probably my second time filling this. I'm still not done with it. Because I'm not, I'm talking more today than anything. So this will be gone after I finish because I'm just thirsty a lot all the time. And um, I will totally smash that and get another drink. Uh, my other favorite is the Henna Placenta Packets. Uh, so this is a dollar for Bella General. This is a, 
this is the ones I like. I haven't been able to get them because everybody's been getting them. And I'm kind of getting married pissed off about it. But that's what I like for my hair. Keep my hair uh, moisturized and soft and stuff. This is my favorite Etsy nail polish. Smoking Hot 700. And I like it a lot. It's brown color. I thought it was just a black color. But I'm, pretty, I'm happy it's not black because I'm trying to get away from black nail polish. So, um, yeah. This is my, that's my first time using Etsy. And uh, I love Etsy. But Etsy is too damn expensive for me. So, yeah. I have a Bath and Body Works. Of course, I can't have a haul or an overview without having something Bath and Body Works related in it. But this is Velvet Sugar. This is something I really love. I got this. I got a whole bunch of lotions and stuff on sale. It came out to under a hundred dollars. No, it came out to eighty because I got like a huge discount with one of the ladies because she was really nice to me because I was nice to her because someone was giving her hell. She thought I was gonna give her hell, but I was really nice to her. She gave me like a big discount of eighty dollars off what I want or what I had and she told me to pick up three more lotions and she was very appreciative of me not giving a hard time please do not give people who work in customer service a hard time I don't give a I mean even if they're in fast food or whatever like those people deserve to be treated better and I hate people who like scream and yell at people who work in those fields because like a lot of them are very young that's their first time job do not be mean to them, please. Be kind. Be kind to everybody who you meet because you never know where your luck could run out. And those people who you are mean to can show up and they'll, they'll be the people who decide your fate. So be nice to people, guys. Uh, and they will, like, reward you. Even if you don't get an instant reward down later on, later, later down in life, it, it, it will reward you. And you'll see the kindness of people come out and, like, uh, the most weirdest ways of experiences. I have like so many stories to that to be honest. But um yeah it's like one of my stories and uh this was twelve fifty but it was like what how much was this? It was like three for twelve fifty so I got a good deal out of that. So I was like heck yeah and I got three of those because I knew I would run out and that's I'm on my second one and I'm slowly but surely using it. And I was like, please don't use, don't run out double sugar. I cannot afford you at full price. I got the Groot this was from a loot crate and I'm not taking out the box because I'm waiting to collect every, you know, Groot. I'm not every Groot, but every character in that area of the Guardians of the Galaxy. And, um, yeah, I really wanted Gam Gam Gamora, but I didn't get her and I got Groot. I was like, man, I want Gamora because I love her a lot and I appreciate her. I got a bunch of Manic Panics on sale. A lot of them came out to under $100. On iDyeMyHair.com, and I know you could get them at other stores, but I got them online because I didn't know and um, love them. I got, uh, and, and people say manic panics work on their hair. You have to leave manic panic in your hair for a long time, but it doesn't, it does not damage that hair, your hair at all. It's vegan, it's cruelly free, and it's semi permanent hair color. And but uh, if you don't wash your hair that often, it will like last in your hair for like a long time. I have manic panic in my hair right now. You can't see it. It is red, and um, I don't wash my hair often. It's been like what? How many? Four or five months, and still in my hair. I'm trying to wash it out now because I want to dye my whole hair a different color. Not telling you guys what color it's gonna be, and um, it's gonna be freaking amazing what color it's gonna be. I have a lot of candles. I didn't want to break them all out, but if you guys saw my closet tour. You will see how many candles I have in my closet. It's not a lot, but it's a lot to me. I'm like, I need to stop. I can't help my addiction to candles. I didn't like candles at all. I hated candles. But for some reason, since last year or so, I was like, candles. Candles, 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 candles. I was like, obsessed with candles. Like, I get stuck on one thing, and I'm obsessed with it, and then I drop it. So, like, I have, like, mini collections of everything. So, I feel like when I get older, I'm going to have, like, a, I'm going to have, like, a whole house filled with, like, mini collections that are not finished. Because so I keep, like, being obsessed over something else. Which is really bad for me, to be honest. Because I need to save money to spend it. So, yeah. This is a, a, how much? That was on sale for $10. Like, every candle that I have has been on sale. Besides the two, two for, besides the two ones from Target, those were full price and they hurt my pocket. But it, was like, but it was like on a gift card, which I didn't really care, but it still hurt me regardless. So I was like, <gasps> Cause I don't, I don't go to Target. I shop online for Target, but I don't go to Target online. I go to Target online a lot, but not in store, which I should, cause it would be cheaper for me. But I go to the game, the Logitech GamePad F three F three ten. 
And I love this. I love this. I love this so much. It is so comfortable. It's very comfortable in my hand. It plays well, and um, it makes noise. But I don't care about the noise. It works for me, and I love it a lot. I'm not. Look, I'm not looking for something that's like gonna be really quiet. Like I don't care. I just. I played a lot. I played with mangas, and it was excellent. It was hard to get used to the controls because that was my first time playing with this controller. And I also played with Rocket Lee a lot too. And I love it a lot. It's just hard because people have different controllers and were, were telling me how to do Rocket League. And I was like, I don't know what you're talking about. I have a different controller. Talk, talking about Target, get off. I got these boots at Target. I still have these boots, guys. It's been like a year or so. And I love these boots a lot. I did a haul on them or review on them long ago. So if you want to see that video, I'll go ahead and link it to you in the comments down below. And the comments below description box down below. I got this from one of my friends. Love her so much for it. It's Sailor Jupiter. And I will explain this story in another video because I it's gonna be uploaded Wednesday. <laughs> and when you guys see this, this will be probably Monday or so of next week. I got these shoes from Y'all General. They were ten dollars. Love us so much. I got these shoes from uh in Best not Birmingham Mall, the Galleria. And um because the mall here where I'm at is not nothing. They don't have what they have. They need to have more clothing shopping options for people my age and they don't. So everybody goes to the Galleria because it has more options to shop at. And uh, I love Vans. I love Vans a lot. I walked into Belks and they have Vans on sale. And I was like, I need new shoes. Gonna take this opportunity while I can. And uh, I love it so much. I love, if anybody knows me well, they know that I love uh, boy shoes. Especially skater shoes are my life. My mom bought me a pair of skater shoes one time and I wouldn't let them go. And she tried to throw them away and I saved them and I threw them away because I was sad to see them go and I wanted to throw them away myself because I wanted I didn't want to part with them but they were falling off my feet and I was like <laughs> you know but I needed it was airwalks. Airwalks were fantastic on my feet. I haven't worn airwalks. I have worn airwalks and they are so comfortable on my feet. I was like, yes. But I have uh back from body works again, honey speckle, wallflower. Home famous refills. These are originally twelve fifty, but I got myself for two fifty, and they always have these sales about getting trying to like clean out their clearance or clean out their inventory to put new inventory in. And I happen to get that. I want to get more of these because they taste, smell so good and they last a long time for me. A lot of people say they don't last long with them, but for me personally, they last long for me, and that's why I like it. Um, I got this wig from AB Hair, and um, I love this hair so much. It's so beautiful. I'm gonna cosplay with all my wigs because. I need to. I need to. I seriously need to. This pillow is very old and dirty, but I don't care. It's a zebra pillow from Walmart. I don't know where to get these pillows. I looked up all over online and everything. Cannot find them. So if I know, if I if anybody knows about these zebra pillows at Walmart, they're like ten twenty dollars. I need two more. I already need, no. I need four more pillows like these. So, but if anybody knows where these are, please tell me, and I'll. Go ahead and get them. Uh, these aren't a, these aren't covered or slip cover or anything. These are actually zebra pillows. And when I first got this, everybody stole my damn pillow. Everybody did, and I was very pissed off and upset about it. Even somebody who was sick on there stole my pillow, and I was like, I am not about that life at all, you know. And I was trying to take my pillow, and people were, like, were trying to take it away from me, and I was like, never again. We're never separating again. And I had this pillow for about three years. I should throw it away, but I need a replacement really bad because I'm not letting this go until I get a replacement. Like this pillow's been through it hell, but I'm so I'm so I like it because when I first had it, it was clean. It was very soft. It was very cozy. That was freaking dirty and crap because people keep touching it and stuff. And uh, even people try like even my ex husband tried stealing this pillow away from me. And I was like, not today, not today, John Boy. That's not his name. I had to put another name in there, but you guys know what I mean. Anyways, this is a Toshiba laptop that I got from school. It's very big. It's very wide. This is my this is like my first laptop that's like so freaking huge, and it's very lightweight. Surprising how big it is. But there's one issue that happened. Don't know how it happened. I'm very upset about it. This happened. 
Yep, that happened. And it happened on day where I needed it, unfortunately. So, um, I'm going to get it fixed. I have somebody who's going to fix it. I'm going to buy the, uh, my, sister's, my sister for my Christmas present. It's going to buy me the screen. And I'm going to give him the uh, tools to fix it. So that way I, um, you know, can fix, he can fix it and I can have a working laptop again. Because once this is fixed, I will use this a lot. This will help me, like, with, because I have a slow laptop right now and it's not working for me. Because I do a lot of, I play games on here. Like, it's really fast and uh, it's work, it works out so well for me. And it happened to break, the screen happened to break and I don't know how I did it. And I was talking to customer support, Toshiba, and I told them the screen broke, and they sent me to someone else, and it was like, they were like saying it's going to cost me like over $600 to fix it. And I was like, oh no. Like, I was like, uh-uh, I'm not paying for it. I'm going to go ahead and get a new one. But it sucks that they don't cover for that kind of insurance. I don't know why, but I'm going to go ahead and get, once I get that replaced, I'm going to go ahead and get insurance on it for the outside, because... Uh, they only cover what happens inside, not outside, like uh, facial features, which I already knew, but I just wanted to know the price, but that lady just kept talking, talking to me. Like, she thought that I said something was wrong inside. I told her, no, it's not. Like, I'm not stupid. I work with, I work with computers. I know what I'm talking about. And I guess she was just trying to be thorough, but she was, like, really irritating me. And I was just like, get me off this phone to somebody else, please. I, didn't, I wasn't mean to her or anything. I was, like, very nice, but inside my racist building, I was like, uh-huh, oh my God. But I have clothes for you guys, and then I'll be done with the video. Uh, a lot of these clothes are from She Inside and from online shopping places, but uh, I will tell you, I'll tell you guys where these are from. This is from Amazon Black Hoodie, and um, I had a hard time finding a black hoodie to fit me because, you know, guys, I'm very tall and big not like not like fat fat but like it's it's like clothes fit me a weird way and uh yeah i got this from she inside and i'm very pissed about this because it's i want this in a large and it looked very cute on the model the model was very cute and she she looked like she was rocking it but unfortunately it's in the japan like size and I was like hell yeah you know I'm freaking Chinese I can fit this because the boobs my boobs are too big my boobs are big guys so I was like <laughs> my boobs are big why and uh, my torso was very long so anything like short like that it's gonna like make me look ugly so I was like no not not like that but if I lose my weight I probably can fit those because like if I can those, those, those are probably a medium in my size so I probably have to use I'm not losing weight for the clothes I'm losing weight in general but when I lose weight I want to rock those clothes hell yeah this is also a Shein Shy uh uh we call that sweatshirt thingy I woke up like this Beyonce I do want to wear this because that that I just I just want to wear it this is also another shirt I want to wear but I can't fit it is a uh, Geek Squad and also, I don't know how much these are. They were on sale, I think. And they were like flash shells on She Inside. So like, when you get them, they're not, lo they're not longer on the website. So I do apologize for that. But if you go to She Inside, just be careful of the sizes. They're not American sizes. They're not American sizes. So like, you just have to like go, you have to really guess. So a lot of them could be a hit or a miss, but a lot of them can be a miss. Because I had a lot of clothes from online shopping clothes. I had a lot of clothes from online shopping because I love online shopping. But I'd rather go to the store and pay full price than get something that I can't fit and have it in my closet for years. Not about that life. I also have an Ariel, my favorite freaking Disney character. Boom. And I love her so much. I love Ariel. And my second favorite character for uh, Disney is Mulan. I love Mulan a lot. This is from a Loot Crate. His cats with a skull. Can't fit it because my chest is too damn big. <coughs> <coughs> and uh, it's very small. Because uh, a large is a medium basically in America. And it sucks so much. I'm not sure why women's sizes are like ridiculously small. And we have to go up more another size and it makes us feel like really self-conscious self about 
of our <coughs> of our weight. <coughs> but I do apologize. Uh, I'm kind of like sick, but not really. I have, I don't know where it is. This these shirts are from. I forgot, but I will post a link to where I got these shirts from. They're nerdy shirts, and that's all you can see. There's Drake on here. If you guys didn't notice, Drake's like the awkward man. Boom. And I wore this a lot when I was pissed off at people. I was like, I don't need new friends. I got friends. And uh, I got uh, Second is the Best. You know, freaking like uh, Mario Kart reference if you guys didn't know. And I love Mario Karts. I grew up playing Mario Karts and Mario games, so I'm a big fan of that. And uh, last but not least is something I'm wearing. It's a sports bra. Got it from Dollar General. I don't know how much it was. No, it was $3. Yeah, it was three dollars, and they were on sale. I was like, I'm getting these, and these, this is a medium on me. Yeah, this is a medium. I'm surprised a medium can fit on me, because my bra size is ridiculous, <laughs> and um, I thought I thought I had to get a large, but a medium works and fits me best. I was like very shocked, but I guess uh, sports bras and bras in general just fit me differently, so that really surprises me. But that's all I have. Hopefully I did everything, including everything in this video. If not, I'll go ahead. I'll have to go ahead and record it again. So, yeah. Um, thanks for watching, guys, and I appreciate if you give us a like. And if you make it to the end of the video, just type uh what you got for this Christmas, or what you got, or what's your best gift you ever gotten, or like what's what's really what you loved like the most in 2014 or 2015. I would to know and type down um, Nico Nico Ni because I'm a weeboo and I love anime. So peace out.